Hi everyone, welcome back to Rachel's Dimple Hopper channel. I just wanted to say a big thank you for those of you who saw my last video and commented and subscribed as well. It meant the world to me. I do have a separate main channel that I was working on on my Disney videos, but recently I made this new Rachel's Dimple Hopper channel solely for my Disney videos and it just feels really special to have you guys on with this new channel as well. So yeah, so I'm really looking forward to taking you on my unboxing journeys with my ever growing Disney collections. Today I've got a few more bags to show you. A few bags that I've had a few days and so I was just waiting to shoot this video and two boxes that came today. I haven't actually unboxed so I'll be doing that with you today. Uh, I just wanted to say I watched Raya and the Last Dragon today on Disney Plus. Um, it was premiered worldwide on Disney Plus and in cinemas where you could go to cinemas in the countries um, it was premiered and um, I've got friends in Korea who were able to view it in IMAX as well in the cinemas. I was so jealous because in the UK we're actually in, uh, still in national lockdown. So for me, I had to stay at home to watch it on my small TV on Disney Plus. But it was still really good. I absolutely loved the film. But I wish I was um, like at the cinema um, experiencing the whole kind of IMAX. But oh well, we just have to go with the flow and hopefully one day I can uh, view it at the cinema as well. So the first bag I'm going to show you is uh, this beauty. It was a re-release of one of the special grails. Ta -da -da -da. Here you go, Sleeping Simba from uh, Lounge Flights, the mini backpack. And um, I loved it when people had it. It's one of the grail kind of past backpacks that um, it was released a few years ago and it got re-released recently and uh, I did love it from the photos of people who had it but I think I love it even more in real life. I was so surprised how much I loved the first look of this backpack. It's absolutely gorgeous and look at little Simba there sleeping on the branch. So cute. The pattern on the bag overall, don't know if it can, you can see but it's like a 3D kind of pattern. African pattern, it's absolutely gorgeous. Obviously Simba is like another layer, layer as well, so he's really cute on there. It's got two side pockets and the lining is also super cute. And the lining is like a really vibrant, colorful lining like that. So I was really happy to get my hands on this one. It was one of my grails from the past and um, yeah, to be able to get it from for retail is really cool. So um, yeah, that was one of my grails checked off my list. Um, another grail that was released last week, I think, was the Mickey Clouds and uh, Starry Night Blue Raja the Back Lounge from my backpack on Truffle Shuffle um, um, in the UK. I completely panicked in the morning and my all my sites crashed on every single one of my devices that morning. So I actually didn't manage to get any of them, uh, Mickey Klaus or Raja, but there is going to be a second drop with um, the other half of the bags to be released, so I think it's this month in March, so hopefully I can get Raja, he's my main one that I really want, so hopefully I can stay calm enough um, on the morning, on the day, that I, so I can get that. Uh, here is another bag that came to me a few days ago. Ta -da! It's the Dumbo in the bathtub mini lounge fly backpack. You see, super cute. So in the um, UK, this was an exclusive from uh, Very Nico. Uh, they have a catwalk membership where you can get uh, grail releases earlier than general release. And yeah, I snapped him up. Um, when he was released. I'm absolutely delighted with him. I saw him on Box Lunch in the US and I thought it was super cute but um, to have him in the UK from Rory Nico was extra special. It's just such a cute face. Look at him! And uh, it is a pocket on the front as well on the bathtub and it's got bubbles on there and the lining is also super cute I'll show you it inside as well there's the kind of brown metal plaque right there close-up view of Dumbo super cute in the bathtub look at his kind of two <laughs> hairs on the top and the lining I think 
is my favorite part because look how cute the pattern is in there look at the bubbles the different kind of poses of dumbo absolutely gorgeous and yeah i'm so happy to be able to have him and this is sleeping simba that i showed before so you can see simba is sleeping so cutely right on the front pockets got the lounge fly on gold plated zips um, and the pattern is 3D embossed and the metal plaque is right there. I'll show you a closer look at the pattern. And here's the pattern inside Sleeping Simba, isn't it? So bright, vibrant, so fun. I absolutely love this lining. It's absolutely the best. So the next two backpacks I'm going to show you, I kind of opened the box to see what it is, but I haven't actually unboxed it fully yet. So it's going to be my first impressions of the bags as well. So the first one is, ta-da, I don't know if you can see which one it is, but it's a really fun one that I've had um, my eye on for quite a long time. It was available on Very Nico in the UK and it's still on the website. Um, I think Very Nico also have 25% off sale today on selected lounge fly bags. I haven't actually checked on which bags the offer is on, but um, yeah, it might be a good kind of offer to um, get if you want one of these lounge fly backpacks. I don't know if it's eligible for this one in particular, but ah, here you go, it's a fluffy Donald. It's the fluffy Donald backpack from Loungefly. It's so cute. Look at the front pocket and how fluffy it is on the size and the back. And I think these are the best bits, right? <gasps> the two little feet paddling along. That is so cute. So I had this, um, my eye on this for quite a long time and I kept say, seeing it on Very Nico and I kept putting it inside and out my basket and like um, umming and ahhing about it but I didn't want it to go out of stock after all this so um, yeah I just decided to completely go for it. It's actually really cute. The lining seems to be a plain red one for in the front pocket. I don't know if it's going to be the same inside but I'll have a look. Um, yes, yeah, so cute. I can't wait to wear this in the park. Look how, look how fluffy that is. I don't even know if that catches on camera. <gasps> that I need to be careful when it rains though, doesn't it? Because that's going to get, um, if it gets wet, that was, that's going to get dirty really easily. But hopefully I can wear it just on sunny days so it doesn't get dirty. Yeah, inside it's just got a red, fun red colour inside. And I'll just double check if it's got an inner zipper. It's got, it's not a zipper, but it's got an inner pocket on the back. So there's plenty of storage in this one. And the fluffy side parts as well, they're actually pockets. So you can actually put um, stuff in the sides. Oh, it's such a soft leather. I didn't even realize how soft this leather is. Obviously it's faux leather because it's lounge fly, but it's really soft. Like even softer than some of these other ones um, that I have. So overall, I'm so happy with this, and I can't wear um, w wait to wear it in the park. It's just so fluffy. Right, the next backpack is going to be the last bag that I'm going to show you, but I'm um, equally as excited as the other ones. I don't know if you can guess what it is. It's one of the taller ones, I think, than the mini backpacks, but. It's Ariel and Eric on the Kiss the Girl Gondola scene backpack. So I definitely wanted to get this one. It was just a matter of when I get it. And the, um, there was a UK site called The Movie Chef and they had, I think over the weekend, um, had a massive sale, 20% off um, sale on in-stock lounge flight and this bag was part of it. So I was going to get um, this bag anyway so if you can get it on the cheap then it's a bonus uh, this is what is inside the box I think they also sell like other goodies like um, fungo pops and games and other kind of bags as well and that's their logo in the center if you want to have a look I'll put all the websites in the description as well so this one was from the movie shack <sighs> Ah, finally it's in my hands. I actually pre-ordered it 
and then uh, it kind of took long um, for it to come to the UK so I cancelled it and got another lounge fly bag and thought uh, I'll get it when it comes in stock and finally it did come in stock and to get it in the sale is um, such a bonus because I definitely wanted this one so we've got Ariel and Eric in the boat that is so cute it's a chibi character one and the leaves it's actually embossed so um, that's actually a really cool texture on there as well I love the uh, background on there as well you can see flounder and the fishies in the water this is actually a front pocket and I can already see the lining is super fun I'll show you um, that inside and it's got two fun side pockets the metal plaque is on the side and the back has Sebastian on it so cute definitely one of my favorite parts of the bag there you go and the lining is super super fun oh I love it I'll show you the lining in more detail close up uh, here's the close-up of the Ariel and Eric Little Mermaid backpack from Loungefly. It's one of my favourite scenes from this film. I also have a puzzle of the scene on my wall that took absolutely ages to do during the first lockdown we had in England. Um, the sides look like that. Cute little Sebastian on the back. Very cute. And I'll also show you the lining. There we go, I took the packaging out so I can show the lining properly. Isn't that so fun? Look at all the seashells, Flounder and Sebastian and the chibi kind of animation. That lining is my favourite part, I think it's so fun, so vibrant. I absolutely love this one and I'll check if there's an inner pocket as well. Yes, there is. There's an inner zipper in there as well. So tons and tons of storage. It is slightly taller than some of the other mini backpacks. So um, I'm definitely going to be using this one with my iPad. It's so fun. I absolutely love this one. I also have the full set. So this is the bag. I've also got the wallet that I showed in a past video that has Ariel, Eric on there and Sebastian on the back and I absolutely love the metal lounge fly tags. I can't stand the fabric ones for some reason. I also, because I loved this set so much when I pre-ordered, got the whole set. I got the pin as well. So let me open this and show you more closely. Okay, so I've got the packaging of the pin as well. So I've got the full set of this style. I absolutely love the whole um image i love the chibi characters my favorite scene my favorite princess my favorite film and i just knew i had to get the whole set so this is the lounge fly pin of uh ariel and eric's kiss the girl gondola scene limited edition limited edition of 1000 and we've got cute little sebastian on the back as well in the uk i got this from double box toys i'll leave a link in the description if you're in the us it should be still available on loungefly.com so you can go and check that and it's a sliding one so the water flounder and the fishies slide over i've got a few of these sliding uh loungefly pins uh, they're super super fun to collect. I think they're really good quality. They can't cannot be traded in the parks uh, because they're not officially just Disney branded. They're from Loungefly, but I absolutely love collecting these boxed limited edition pins. So hopefully I can do more videos of more of these pins when they come. And that's the whole set looking good all together. Well, thank you for joining me today as well on another fun Disney unboxing video. I absolutely love doing these unboxing videos with you and I can't wait for the next one. Uh, until next time then, I hope you all stay safe, have a magical day and I'll see you next time everyone. Bye! Let me try and say bye with Donald's feet. I absolutely love this. Bye everyone, see you next time.